So this is 2022 KCSC Mathematics Paper 2, uh, number 19. A transformation matrix uh, that is 1.5002 math triangle ABC onto ABC plane. Another transformation matrix uh, T2 is equals to 3 minus 2, 2 minus 1 maps triangle ABC onto triangle AB. C double prime. The coordinates of C uh, double prime is 10 and 8, uh, 10, 8, and the area of triangle ABC is uh, 15 square units. Number A, Roman number 1, determine the coordinates of C, uh, and you get 5 marks. Uh, so from here, what we do is uh, this is the uh, so if this is a b uh, that is a uh, this is triangle a uh, b and c it undergoes the undergoes the, uh, the transformation at uh, t1 and also followed by t2 so that's how you you run when you are doing uh, matrices and transformation in form 4 uh, so to, to we need to to get the matrix a single matrix that uh, was used to transform triangle ABC uh, so it gives you a B double prime B double prime and C double prime to get a single matrix that transformed ABC to ABC double prime we multiply the two matrices uh, so when you multiply the two matrices uh, this is what you get uh, so you say it is 1.5 uh, and 0 and we have 0 and 2 uh, no we start with the other one because we are starting with the uh, that with this one so we start with the 3 and minus 2 that order is very important and that is 2 minus 1 we multiply by the other matrix which is 1.5 uh, you have 0 we have 0 and 2 uh, so when you multiply you multiply 3 uh, 3 uh, three times 1.5 that will give you 4.5 minus 2 times 0 that will give you 0 so here we will have uh, 4.5 uh, 4.5 you take 3 multiplied by 0 that is uh, 0 minus 2 multiplied by uh, 2 you get minus 4 uh, so you 2 multiplied by 1.5 that is 3 minus 1 multiplied by 0 is 0 so when you add you get 3 and finally we have 2 multiplied by 0 is 0 and uh, um, minus 1 multiplied by 2 you get minus 2 so that's how you multiply matrices two matrices now from there uh, we say and uh, then it means that uh, since we have been given the coordinates of C, uh, if we assume uh, or we uh, we assume the coordinates of A, B, and C, uh, that is uh, the coordinates of C is uh, X, Y, uh, then we can say if we multiply this matrix, that is 4.5, and we have minus 4, uh, we have 3, and we have minus 2. Uh, then you multiply by the coordinates of C X Y should give you the coordinates of C prime which is 10 8 okay uh, so when you multiply here these two matrices uh, 4.5 times uh, X that will give you uh, 4.5 X plus minus 4 times Y that will give you minus 4 Y is equals to 10 uh, then we have uh, 3 multiplied by x that will give you 3x minus 2 multiplied by y that will give you minus 2y is equals to 8. These are simultaneous equations so you can solve by you can multiply this by 2 and you multiply this by 1. Uh, so what you get is uh, uh, this will give you uh, this will give you when you open the uh, when you open that is 4.5 x and uh, minus 4y is equals to 10 and then we have uh, we have uh, 
uh, we multiply this by 2 you get 6x uh, minus uh, this is 4y is equals 2 you multiply this is 16 uh, then uh, we subtract uh, so this one you, you can say this will give you minus 1.5 and this will give you minus 6 so instead of that we can write this is you divide by minus 1 you get 1.5 or you interchange the two equations is equals to uh, 6 uh, so from there uh, then you'll be able to find that uh, you'll be able to find uh, you'd x is equals to you divide 1.6 by 1.5 you get it is 4 uh, when you get x is equals to 4 you substitute in any of the equation this one or the first one or the second one and you find y is equals to y is equals to to 2 and you will you find that uh, uh, this will be 18 minus 8 that will give you 10 so that satisfies the equation uh, 6 times 4 is 24 minus 8 you get 16 so that is a uh, uh, here we can uh, can put the bracket like that uh, so that is how you get uh, so the coordinates of c are 4 and 2 so the coordinates of uh, c part b uh, determine the area of the triangle of the triangle ABC. Uh, what we know, what we learned is that area scale factor. Uh, let me do using this other color. Area scale factor. Uh, we have uh, area scale factor is equals to the determinant of the matrix of transformation. Our matrix is a uh, four point five. That is, we have found 4.5 minus 4, uh, and we have uh, 3 and minus 2. That is a that is a determinant. So, meaning that uh, when you determinant is you is uh, you multiply by uh, this is 9, and this is uh, the determinant here is uh, we'll be able to get it is equals to. Uh, let's do that multiply 4.2 4.5 multiply by 2 uh, that is uh, 4.5 multiply by 2 we minus uh, uh, 3 multiply by 2 and that will give you uh, minus 9 plus 12 minus 9 plus 12 and that will give you 3 so the determinant is equals to 3 uh, what it means when you get the determinant it because we have been uh, that is uh, the determinant area scale factor it means that uh, uh, 3 is equals to 15 or 3 divided by 1 3 is divided by 1 is equals 15 divided by area of ABC why because this is the area of the image uh, and this is the area of the object uh, that the, it equals to the, uh, 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 the determinant so you find that uh, area of a b c it is equal you cross multiply is equals to 15 divided by 3 is equals to 5 a square unit so that's how you get the area of triangle ABC that is the object uh, we go to part B of the question the coordinates of B and B prime are X Y and uh, 6 X plus 1 are 8 respectively determine the value of Y so to determine the value of Y uh, the, the value of uh, Y X the, determine the value of Y uh, what we do is uh, we say we, the transformation matrix is 4.5 and we have minus the other, the other one is minus 4 uh, the, we have uh, 3 and minus 2 uh, so uh, it means when you multiply uh, the coordinates of uh, B uh, that is the uh, coordinates of B uh, x y should give you the coordinates of b prime b double prime which is 
uh, 6, 6x plus uh, 1 and 8. So when you multiply the coordinate, when you transform, rather it is simply saying when you transform B, uh, you get using this matrix, then you get uh, B double prime. Uh, so we can form two equations. So we can say this is uh, 4.5x uh, minus 4y. That is, you multiply 4.5 multiplied by x and plus minus 4y. That will give you that. Uh, it is equals to 6x plus 1 then 3 multiplied by x that will give you 3x uh, minus 2y that is plus minus 2y minus 2 multiplied by y and that should give you 8 uh, so you can simplify here by the, the simultaneous equations and you will be able to get uh, uh, you, you, you can eliminate x uh, so if you eliminate x, you, you can, uh, so that we are left with y, so we multiply this by 2, and you multiply this by 3. Uh, so that, what you, that, uh, that means that uh, you get this is 9x minus 8y is equals to, you multiply by 2, that will give you 12x uh, plus 2. Then we have, uh, you multiply this by 3, 9x minus uh, 6y uh, uh, is equals to 24. Uh, now we, we get, we'll be able to get, so mi minus minus, 9 minus 9 is 0. 8 minus 8 minus minus 6, that will give you minus 2. Uh, when you minus 2y, is equal to is equal to cos two that is uh, part B of the question we are told the coordinates of point B and B prime are x y and six x plus one and eight respectively determine the value of y so for us to be able to determine the value of y what this means that using the matrix that we have already uh, worked on uh, in the above uh, part a if you transform point b to b prime then x y is transformed to six plus six x plus one and eight uh, so this simply means that if we take 4.5 uh, x uh, 4.5 uh, 4.5 and we have minus 4 this matrix and we have 3 and minus 2 uh, then what it means is that you multiply by the cord matrix formed using the coordinates uh, coordinates of B should give you uh, the matrix formed when you use the coordinates of uh, B prime so 6 plus 1 and 8 so this we can multiply and we will be able to form uh, simultaneous equations which you'll be able to solve and find the value of y so you multiply this you get 4.5 x uh, you multiply minus 4 times y you get minus 4 y is, is equals to uh, 6 x plus 1 and then we have uh, 3 multiplied by x you get 3 x minus uh, 2 y is equals to 8 uh, now you can see here we have x 4.5 x and 4 po and 6 x uh, so what you do is uh, we can take uh, this implies that takes uh, take 6 x to this other side it becomes negative so 4.5 minus 6 x will give you minus 1.5 minus 1.5 uh, x uh, then we have uh, this one F y remains the same minus 4 y uh, is equals to 1 so we use that equation and the second one so we have 3x uh, minus 2y is equals to 8 now we can eliminate x so that we will be left with y to eliminate x we can multiply this equation by 2 and this will multiply by 1 so this implies that uh, we have uh, minus 3x uh, we multiply that we get 8y is equals to 2 then here we have 3x 
uh, minus uh, 2y remains the same because we are multiplying by 1, you get 8. Uh, for us to eliminate y, we can add the two equations so that when you add minus 3x plus 3x, that will be 0. Then we have minus 8 minus minus 8y minus minus 2, that will be minus 8 plus 2, so that will give you minus 6y is equals to minus 6. Divide both sides by x, y, 6 minus uh, 6, so you get y is equals to 1. So you get two marks. So that's how you work out that. And uh, by reaching that point, then you should be able to get uh, 10 marks.